subscribe or this will happen to you. <laughs> yeah, you're not subscribed yet? Come on! Good morning. 7.48 in the morning. Been up for a few hours already. Just the old jet lag. Got our breakfast from the hotel. Nice little breakfast. Thank you very much to the hotel. All the bits and pieces that we need. A little bit of oatmeal, some toast. I um, think we're going to go out for a wee coffee as well. Go for a walk. Absolutely incredible the views this morning. Like, I think we're like in the centre and there's just mountains all around us, which is just like stunning. Pretty cool. And sometimes I guess I have to kind of pinch myself and just be very thankful to, I don't know, just to what's happened and and how things have kind of progressed for, for all of us really in the sport and then we can come up to you know the mountains in Colorado and kind of experience this incredible environment um, with like some of our you know good friends that we compete with so it's, yeah it's really really cool. I'm gonna start crying so I better not. Uh, anyway so what we've we got today I think we've got dead, deadlift, I don't know if it's deadlift first then it's dumbbell for reps and stones and then going back to Brian's, Brian's got a barbecue, he's going to put on the grill, going to have a few beers, um, hang out with all the guys, just just be quite chilled, quite nice. Everything's just been so like easy, which is like a nice thing when you're competing. There's no stress, there's no drama. I really can't big up Brian enough for, for the, the show he's put on and yeah, just a huge privilege to be here and really, really thankful. So. Yeah, I'm gonna eat my breakfast um, and then I'll maybe do a little walk about the place, show you guys some of the views. Jeez, it's class out here, man. Nice and cold, dressed appropriately, obviously. So yeah, I don't know if you can see the views properly, but it is pretty, pretty spicy. A uh, wee bit of zooming in there, Simon. Pretty gnarly. Transportation to the Shaw Classic. It's not that hard. Uh, Looks like we're going to school. To be on time, yeah. is it? On the school bus, mate. So here we are at Shaw Residence number two. And here's the gym. Shaw's second gym. So this is the first event. The Hammer Tire Deadlift. It's going to be pretty cool. You can look at the size of these handles. Look at that. It's a girthy handle, that's all I'm saying. A six stone run. To finish off. Look quite nice stones. <laughs> doo -doo, doo -doo. Big Tommy would be loving this. Jeez, I can't even see James with that. You can't see your body, James. James. What? You can't oh. even see your body, where are you? No, no, don't It's a floating head. Are you going hunting later on? The what's up? Are you going hunting? Yes, sir. <laughs> We're out here in America, you better believe it. I think I'm gonna start calling you Lucky. Oh. And you wanna know why I'm gonna call you Lucky? Okay. Uh oh. Tell because me. you're Tom's brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna start crying. <laughs> I just get invited to these things because I'm Tom's brother. Yeah, hey, come along with it. We can't. I followed you before. I'm the small man. Yeah. Which one was it? The, the good one. The yeah. tall one. The tall, like really strong guy. You can tell him. I follow you on Instagram first. Well, and then you stop following me now, and you're following Tom. Yeah. I start like calling you Tom's brother. Thanks. I'm joking. I love yeah. you. I'm joking. Here we have, You'd already know you're my. Yeah, and here we have Tom's brother in the love press. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> Tom's brother, yeah. Somewhere in the mountains of Colorado. <laughs> A group of men, hungry men, <laughs> looking for elk. In looking for elk. Finally, they come across a house <laughs> to eat and drink till their hearts content. <laughs> Stay tuned to see what happens. What's up, guys? So we're just starting the where are we? Chicago to Heathrow. So hopefully, all you guys have watched the, the competition on the Shaw Classic website, Shaw Elite. Everyone that watched it hopefully kind of saw that all the guys just supported each other. Just such a privilege to be there. Really delighted. Pretty happy with my performance, to be honest. It was a really heavy comp. I haven't trained that heavy kind of going into it. And Tommy, because you did so well in the log press, I didn't forget about you. Bought you a present. So these are your new Oakley's, Tom. So hopefully you'll be smashing the log press now all the time at Worlds. Well, hopefully not when I'm competing. Um, so yeah, original 
Is that the oh, there? Sorry, the original. Look at that. No expense spared for you, Tommy Boy. So getting into Glasgow about 12 in the afternoon, tomorrow, Monday, um, and then getting picked up, and then the drive up the road, four hour drive, back home. When we're coming back from world, it took us a little bit of time to get back into normality. Hopefully you had a nice time in with the whispering launch, Tom. I'm looking forward to seeing that video. I believe you did some vlogging. I might have a couple of whiskeys in the plane, seeing as I'm getting picked up and I don't have to drive. So, I think it's an eight hour flight. I have a couple of whiskeys, try and get some sleep. And then that'll be that. So looking forward to getting home. I'll do a little bit more vlogging when the food comes out. I'm just having my first meal. Let's have a way of looking at it. Let's see what we got. Salmon. Sticky toffee pudding, some cheese crackers. Uh oh. Uh oh. Potato. <sighs> so it's almost like a little bedroom we're in. Yeah, just wanted to see a wee bit about Brian's comp as well. So last night after the comp was finished, we all went back to Brian's, Brian and Kerry's house, and they put on. It was like barbecue food, a heap of food, had loads of beers for us all, and just really looked after us. And then Brian did a nice speech, kind of just saying it was really nice, really nice stuff with what he said. And kind of, I think we all felt it. And then Kerry said a lot of it as well. Obviously, it's a lot of work for them to put on like a show of that level. Like incredible, absolutely incredible. Out of all the six events, so Brian hadn't pressed in the log press before. He hadn't used the yolks, it's not his yolks, it was from Rogue. The dumbbell was from Rogue. So the only like three events that he had, the farmers in frame, he didn't win. The hammer tire lift, tire deadlift, he didn't win. He won the stones, so like for people that are saying that it was fixed for Brian to win, I really don't think it was because, well, he didn't win the events that he should have won, if that makes sense. So. And I hope it came across well in the, the live stream or the, the videos that Brian put out. The atmosphere was incredible. So pumped. There's a group of guys getting together training in the gym and you're like pushing for PBs and stuff. That's what it genuinely felt like. So yeah, just great to be part of it. And just a huge thank you to Brian and Kerry and all the helpers for, for doing such a great show. It was one of the most enjoyable shows I've ever done. So I can't wait, hopefully, we can get back out there, um, get Big Tommy, see how the altitude affects Tom. He should be used to it because he's so tall, so... Anyway, I'm gonna go for a little sleep and we'll catch you when we land in Heathrow. So we've just arrived back in Scotland. This is the, the welcoming home parade. Thanks guys, much appreciated. Bit of a bum note there though. Freedom! Have you ever done any Highland dancing, William? <laughs> I don't even know what Highland dancing is. Do you not? No. Jordan, have you? I've not, no. I don't plan on doing any either. Oh, look at this. Tommy's been here. Bottle of Backfast. <laughs> That's Tom's favourite. Casual ride. What are we, what are we having here? Oh, we're having uh, Meatless Mariana Subway. Oh, foot long. Yeah. Foot long, yeah. Oh. Are you jealous of my real meat? No, I'm not. I stick with my vegetables. Are you happy just eating vegan? I am, man, yeah. I'm, I'm all right with it, yeah. Peace and love. <laughs> Are you happy to have the most amazing man back from? Yeah, by Jordan. the way. What are you making? Bruschetta and vegan pasta. Is that vegan meatballs. What's bruschetta? Is that Vietnamese food, is it? Italian. Is it Italian? It's Italian, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. And then you're making. One bit of bread, two bit of bread, three bit of bread. So something like that. It's a bit dry. Are you excited to diet? How's things, casual ride? <laughs> Pretty good. Are you excited to eat your uh, meatballs? Very excited. That's yeah. the second. Jordan, are you excited to have some more yeah, meatballs? Yeah, man, I'm excited. Partial to a couple of balls in your mouth? <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. William? Oh, indeed. <laughs> are, you, are you confused, <laughs> William, why <laughs> I'm here, but yeah, I'm going to be on the TV? <laughs> It's like it would be weird, isn't it? Still don't get it. Uh, <laughs> I, I can see the confusion in your face. So we just watched uh, 
written strong as well, so it was pretty cool. Congratulations to our good friend, Adam Bishop, the King of Britain. See? Congratulations, Adam. Yeah, you did awesome, Adam. Really happy for you, really proud of you. Um, smashed it as per usual. Yeah, a little poxy Brit. Going to see Tom, Dad and that tomorrow morning. I think we're going to go out for breakfast, get a little munch. Um, and we've got stuff to sort. The main thing we have to sort is the Stoltman Games that we're going to have next year. So that's going to be a big thing to get organised. So I think we're going to start organising that as soon as possible. It'd be pretty cool to see if we could do that, especially in, in our little town of Invergordon. It'd be nice. Um, again, give something back to the community. Because um, obviously all you guys have been so good to us and support us, so it's about time I think Tom and I did something to give back. So yeah, just a few things to plan. I'm really excited for 2021. I think it's going to be an awesome year. Obviously, all you guys have made 2020 a really good year for us. We've hit, it might not seem a lot to a lot of people, but 100,000 subscribers, that's something that we've, um, you know, pushed for for the last couple of months since Simon's come on board. Special thank you to Simon, obviously, for doing all this. You can leave that in, Simon, because you don't get enough credit, so thank you very much. And yeah, just dead happy to be home. Excited to see family, spend nice Christmas together and smash training in 2021. Are you excited, Kush? Stay safe, smile and stay spicy. Keep ringing that little bell. Come on, Kush. Ding, ding, ding. Ding, ding. ding. <laughs>